going on? Welcome to OTGW Adventures. Yeah! Today's just me and Dan because we're in a very cramped space right here. That's right, that's right. And our adventures took us all the way to Brooklyn. So that's today we are going to talk about egg tarts. Yes! Which you know is one of the most awesome desserts. The first time I had an egg tart, I blew my mind. But then the first time I had a Portuguese egg yeah, tart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My mind, my already blown yeah, mind yeah, yeah. just like blew up some okay. more. So today we're talking about the differences between Hong Kong egg tarts and Portuguese egg tarts. So this is a regular dan tart. To me it's all about the crust, uh -huh. okay? So a normal looking one, you don't get a flaky crust like that. Okay. A normal looking one, you get kind of like... By the way, the... you touched my dan tart. Oh, that's it? You touched it. That's just... That's... How am I supposed to eat this dan? This is your dan. That's mine. That's mine. Uh, Let's take a look at the Portuguese dan. Wait, first of all, can I just say? Yeah. So when we came here, yeah. you have to order them. Uh, yeah, I, yeah. You like, had to call ahead yeah. and order these. They're not sitting in right. some kind because of shelf. Because they make them to order. It's hot. It's hot. It's hot right now. My hand Let's is open hot. Open this up. Okay. If you guys never had one of these, first of all, this isn't jam. This is not this black thing right here. Yeah. That's the caramelization. It's the difference in the crust, how flaky it is, and that they make it freshly from the oven. And uh, also, there's a little uh, layer of glaze on top. So this is a regular Hong Kong uh, egg tart. Yeah. And compare this to a Portuguese. Oh my God, there's so much filling in here. I bet it's you about it's to break jiggered. apart. Yeah. It's, it's about to break apart. Oh my God. The, skin, the flaky skin is so oh. light. Oh, oh my God. God. So take a look at these two egg tarts. Like, which one would you rather have? Seriously. Exactly. But we still gotta try this. We gotta try it. Okay, so okay. let's try the let's regular tan All right, ready? Ready? Take it's so much heavier. This is not a bad one. Like, if I didn't have these, you would eat this. I would be perfectly happy with this. I find this skin too much. Too much. Okay, but I've had way worse though. Now grab right. your Portuguese puta. Oh yeah. And uh, this is your first time having it. This yeah. is my second time. Oh my god. Take oh. a bite. Oh. Oh my god. So let me tell you how amazing this is. The texture is like a perfectly steamed egg, which it's all so Asians tender. love steamed egg, right? It's so tender. It's so tender. It's not too sweet. This is really sweet. Yeah. I can taste the butteriness and then also that caramelized uh, yeah. uh, syrup on the top. Yeah, you can taste that glaze. Yeah. Would you consider this one of the best Portuguese egg tarts you ever had? No, this is the best yeah. Portuguese egg tart. I thought so. I thought so. I have another good thing to say about these. Yeah. So these, these came out about half an hour ago, right? We've been shooting, we've been talking. They're still hot as heck. So you could actually get this, bring them home. This you know what we can also do? What's that? Take them back, put it in the fridge, and what you want to do um, is when you eat it, pop it in your toaster oven, you can still heat it up like that. Oh, I haven't tried that. Yeah, you can do it. Definitely try this place out, guys. Well, right away. One, right away when it's piping hot, get that flavor before you take it home to your uh, oh family. Gosh. Thanks so much for watching OTGW Adventures. See you later. later.